scanner that comes with the, the kit. It's Bluetooth. It uses a Bluetooth and talk control. It's an app that you can download. It costs about two pounds, three pounds. And you can read codes from your Prius. The RPM here is what the engine's doing. You don't normally see this on the Prius. Um, the state of charge of the battery, the hybrid battery, is 59%. I'll switch the kit off for a moment. The amps of the hybrid battery, we've got 11 amps and 222 volts on the hybrid battery. Display is 95 kilometers per hour. Speed limit here is about 120 kilometers per hour, 70 miles per hour. What I want to show you is some driving techniques to use blended mode using more electric power because the kit will allow us to use the electric power at uh, high speeds. There are some parameters that have to be satisfied before the car will do that. One of them is HVSOC, for it will allow you to go into blended mode. phase and that's to get the cat temperature up so that if the engine does come on and it's used that the catalytic converter is, is hotter and can be used uh, efficiently. A lot of the Prius features are related to the angle of depression of the accelerator. If the accelerator is down too hard EV modes will not be used because the, uh, the Prius is designed only to use EV for a very short time. To reclaim energy that was uh, to use energy that was reclaimed during braking, and usually there isn't that much energy available. So, depending on the depression of the accelerator, the computer car computer will decide whether to use EV blended mode. flat bit coming up so I just want to show you that we have some flat ground where we can do a quick test of the high speed EV. Now the 
car's been charging while we're driving, so the amp output has dropped. It's detected that we're quite high, and the SOC is at 65. When the voltage of the HV battery goes up, the kit converter will reduce its power output. Now we're still taking on power, so what I'll do is I'll we're doing 106k kilometers per hour, so we'll take so we've got it charged up, so everything else is ready to go into EV mode. Let's overtake these guys. So the kit's off right now. If the kit's on, the car thinks there's some braking regeneration going on and won't allow you to use the blended mode at high speed. So you have to switch the kit off before trying to use the mode. We'll just do it at the bottom of this straight here, bottom of this hill. Your SOC is good, it's above 60. Okay, I'm going to put the car into EV mode. It's, it's already in blended EV, where the amps are using about four, six, six amps and the revs are at 212. So now I'm going to switch the kit on. I will keep the revs at around 2000. Now that's pretty good. We're at 2000 RPM and we're doing 123 kilometers per hour see that, as you can see, the voltage of the hybrid battery is staying at 240. Using this blended mode, at this speed, we're not using up much electrical power. And that's enough electrical power coming out of the kit to keep us using blended mode HV, which keeps the revs really low and keeps our fuel consumption really low. So for short trips, driving into the city, you will use fuel. Um, but we're using not very much fuel at all. We're using a, probably about three, four litres per hundred kilometre. Once the car is in blended mode at high speed, it will allow you to continue using it. It just doesn't like to switch into blended mode if the kit's on. So you have to switch the kit off first and then switch it on once you're into blended mode driving at high speed. So we're doing some blended mode. We're at 1227 on the revs, 1200 revs. Breaking, it's dropping below a thousand. We're at 70% SOC, so the car will probably allow us to drive in EV mode. But yeah, the revs are at zero. Well, above 70% HV SOC, um, the car detects that there's enough electrical power in the system drive in electric mode and we'll prefer using that until the SOC comes down to about 65, 60. When we're parked we're going to be using about 3 amps. Okay we've got the kit on, we're at 242 volts so the kit's not putting much power. The fan of the kit's not on, you can't hear it, which means it's using a, it's converting a very small amount, it's not overheating. We're accelerating an EV. engines come on, only to about 1300 revs. Turn my foot off the gas, see if we can get into blended mode EV. Very low fuel consumption here, only about 1100 RPM. It's a slight decline. I'm not going to do very much high speed driving, I'll get over 50 around here, so I'll switch the car into EV mode. Now the revs won't come up at all until we're at our destination.
not destination. SRC is holding at 69. If I were to switch the kid off, I would just fall very quickly. 